What is up everybody? Welcome back to the Maths Guy. Today we are looking at how to work out the volume of a rectangular prism. Let's jump into it. Okay, so first of all, a rectangular prism is a 3D shape with six faces which are all rectangles. And the volume is the amount of space that it takes up. So all this space in the center of the shape. And to find out the volume, we have this really nice easy formula, length times width times height. And because we are using only multiplication, and multiplication is commutative, it actually does not matter which way around we do the calculation, we will still get the same answer. So let's see what this looks like with example number one. We can see we have this rectangular prism here, and on the front face, this face facing us, we have lengths eight centimeters and three centimeters, because this five is measuring this line here, this edge, whereas this three centimeters are these vertical edges. But let's start by writing down our formula. So we have volume equals length times width times height. And let's now start to plug in some of our numbers. So I'd have volume equals eight times three. That's giving us our length and height of this first face. And then I'm gonna multiply that by the width, and the width is five centimeters. So now that we can solve, we can do volume equals eight times three, which is 24 times five. Therefore volume equals 120. And let's not forget our units of measurement, our centimeters. And because now we're in the 3D space, measuring volume, we are looking at cubes. So therefore our answer is 120 centimeters cubed. Let's put this into another order just to prove that we can do the multiplication in any order. Let's do five times three times eight. Five times three is 15 times eight equals 120. So we get the same answer. Okay, let's look at the same thing for question two. This time we have two centimeters, three centimeters and 10 centimeters. So I can do my volume equals length times width times height or volume equals two times three times 10, therefore volume equals six times 10, volume equals 60 centimeters cubed. Easy, and there you have it. Let's look at the things to remember. A rectangular prism is a three-dimensional solid bound by six rectangular faces. The formula for volume is length times width times height, and remember, this is commutative. Doesn't matter which way around we put it, we're gonna still get the same answer. But remember to always include your units in your answer. Your turn, have a go at working out these two questions. Put your answers in the comment section. Let's see how you get on. And there you have it. Thank you very much for watching. Hopefully this video has been helpful for you. If it has, share it with a buddy that you think might also benefit from learning it. But for now, peace out.